We are our bodies. We see the outside all the time, but that's less than half the story, the surface, the exterior. We know far less about what's inside. Our lungs, kidneys and heart, organs and muscles, arteries and veins, they do their jobs unseen. But for anatomists, the doctors and artists who have struggled through the centuries to understand how our bodies actually work, getting inside dissection was vital. In these two films, we are investigating the beautiful synthesis between discoveries in anatomy and the works of art that illustrate them. Asking the question, how have anatomy and art inspired each other? On our journey, we'll see some of the greatest works of art in the world. In this film, we tell the story of two men who lived 1,400 years apart, but whose works still stand the test of time. The most influential doctor ever to study our anatomical structure was called Galen. He lived and worked in Rome in the second century AD. Galen's ideas influenced some of the greatest artists of all time, including Leonardo da Vinci, and his teachings held sway for more than 1,500 years after he died. And at that time, in 1537, a young man arrived in Padua in Italy to continue his studies in surgery. In just seven years, Andreas Vesalius went from being a student who stole bodies from the gibbets to being the most famous anatomist in the whole of Europe his drawings the benchmark for anatomical illustrations for hundreds of years to come. 